sure are a lot more Outlanders now that the Sakoku Decree has been abolished. When I don't have much to keep me occupied, old thought patterns start to creep back in and... As soon as I start talking about it, the flashbacks start. Honorary Knight, Paimon! Good news! We have some new helpers! These two store owners heard about our charity sale. They want to donate their earnings and join us. What? A donation? I... Absolutely! Each extra donation means one... This year's Vine Laser Fest is busier than previous years, so we met our... T it doesn't seem right to leave the important task of caring for our most vulnerable to you alone. We just want to help however we can. Yeah... Aww, hmm. But this does mean we'll have to change the name of our shop. Alright, let's give this all we've got and make this a... Fresh flowers and general goods! Folks, grab bargains at... Huh? Hey, look, it's Albino! Uh, hello there. to buy anything in particular, Alp? I'm not in dire need of anything right now. I just heard that you were running the Knights of Avonia stall and thought I'd come over. As it happens, Timaeus and I made some progress in our research recently, so I took the opportunity... Aww, so you came all the way here just to help us out? Let's take a look here. We've got bottles of... Wait, what is it? That's an extra strong sobriety po- Please, hand them out for free to anyone who needs them. Sounds like a super useful- Oh, 
Uh, I most likely wouldn't have had but now. Uh, definitely. Well, Paimon assumes so, because it would definitely ruin the mood if someone fell into the lake or tripped over a rock after having one too many glass. Yeah, Albedo, you should take some snacks. All right, then. I I had no idea you... It's a savvy choice of location for if any other night of Favonius were run... Wow, getting complimented by... Anyway, it sounds like you... Well, I provided a dozen or so landscape paintings. They must have been worth a... F well, the people buying... Some felt that my painting style was this plus the sizable prof... She used her personal connections to apply for some sort of certification for my artwork. I believe they call it... Later, many artists began to imitate my landscape paintings, and they became a common sight throughout Mondstadt. According to the rules of the copyright that Alice applied for, the artists need to pay me a portion of their revenue for each landscape painting up. Wealth was never one of my goals. I don't care where the money goes, so I entrusted it to the Knights of Favonius, and I suppose it would be fitting to use it to pay for the destruction that Alice has created. But from what I hear, they use it all on charitable initiatives, which is also- You never cease to amaze, Albedo! Though it was hardly my original intention, I have come to embrace my unexpected philanthropic achievements. Thank you. Uh, <clears throat> well then. Thanks for your contribution. Come again when you're free.
found you. Huh? Wait! You came here looking for us? Of course! Do you have any idea how popular your charity stall is? Everyone's been talking about it. Favonian Goodies and Buddies, run by the honorary knight and their sidekick, is selling all kinds of fantastic treasures and even giving away some wonderful others for free. Don't miss out. Uh, so after all that, Paimon's back to being the sidekick? Mm. Anyway, what have you two been up to these days? Did you go off on a trip or something? We haven't seen you around the whole festival. <laughs> That's because we're still working. Huh? You still have... Technically, Amber and I are on a vacation schedule. There are more merchant caravans than usual traveling the route between Dormanport and Mondstadt City during the festival. Extra traffic means extra security is required. Because of monsters and bandits and stuff? Yes. The Reconnaissance Company is tasked with patrolling this route during the fest as well as traveling with the car- <sighs> That seems- Of course not. While one team is on duty, another is resting, and a third team is on step. These three teams rotate periodically. Yule is such an experienced captain. She arranged everything this way so that the reconnaissance company- Yes, all right, Amber. I did my job like I always do. I really don't- Enough, both of you. The festive spirit is turning you into giddy little children. <clears throat> anyway, we didn't come here just to chit-chat. I'll let Eula do the honors. Okay. I need 40 portions of Knight's Special Northern Smoked... That's such a huge order! Wait, are the Knights of Avonius having an official feast? <laughs> Nothing quite as glamorous as all that. Captain Eula wants some supplies to reward her team members with. Correct. Scouts use up an enormous amount of energy in a single day. Each meal, they eat enough to... Plus, a long-standing member has recently returned to our ranks after a long absence. Of all the things I could have bought, I thought it would be best to have the money go to you. Paimon agrees! You made the right decision, Yula. It's also about this long-standing member you meant. Mika, the frontline land surveyor. He was a vital member of our team. Mika! Yeah, that's the one! Paimon... Mika's not afraid of you guys. That was his way of showing respect to you. Although, admittedly, he thinks all mighty people have unique personalities and prefers to understand what makes them tick and the way they think. He says it makes it easier to communicate that way. He was the same way toward me and Amber at first. As we grow- Interesting. Sounds like Mika's the one- Mm-hmm. It'll just take a little time, that's all. You are a high-profile figure within the Knights of Favonius. As his command- uh, It's all right, Eula. We get it. You're just looking after- Wait, Eula, did you just pay for my portion too? I was supposed to pay for mine separately. I'm not an official member. <sighs> if you want to get official about it, then fine. It's officially my treat. 